Why, hello there! Welcome back to my Let's Play, guys. My name is Modus517, and I'm here to play some Minecraft, and today it's dark out in my world because I haven't slept yet, and I just kind of wanted to show off the Woodbury, Woodbury feel in the night. And there's a skeleton that's breached the perimeter. How did you get in here? How did you get in here, sir? Makes me wonder, what is it? Whoa. Whoa. That's kind of cool looking. It's like, oh, if trapdoors could really be like that, they weren't so thick, they were all thin and sleek that'd be awesome oh well oh well but yeah how did he get in here is it too dark over here do i need some light probably need some light right over here looks a little dark but whatever but yeah i want to show off woodbury in the dark because i've added uh i've added some things i've covered up the uh the entrance way over there because someone was like dude you need to cover that and i was like that's a good idea so i covered it up and then i added a bunch of grass back here because obviously you know i don't i can't spare the fuel for my lawnmower so it's gonna get a little bit chaotic back here it's like a little jungle and i like it i just need to kind of get rid of the flowers to really kind of get get away from that happy feel and i like it and there's an enderman just chilling up there i kind of want to kill him but i'm not ready for battle but you know what i haven't killed an enderman in a while so i'm gonna go kill him come here buddy let me say oh you stole the block from fnr's house yep you deserve to die you're going down big jump oh do you take fall damage 360 180 kill you oh i didn't get the dirt block back or an ender pearl that's just insulting oh wow now i'm gonna have to fix the house but oh well now that my uh my pre-episode shenanigans are over what i'm gonna do this episode is is uh, i'm gonna keep working on fall shelter like usual but i'm almost done with it i would say like i still have a little bit more to go but i think i can do a majority of it off camera but i've done some work like well actually no i haven't done like any work because last episode you guys saw I did this whole thing. I was about to say that I did all this off camera, but I recall that I recorded it. But I actually shaped out this over here where I got, well, actually, oh, I, I guess I forgot to fill these in. I was tired. I, you know, I did a lot of digging. I didn't fill all, like, I have to fill all these in with, uh, you know, the brick to make it, like, match. But, you know, I kind of shaped out these rooms. So these will be the corridors for the uh, security guards. You know, you got, like, two each, so you'll have eight security guards total. And then uh, right here, you'll have, this will be our barracks. And I kind of like it because there's water right above here, like, the we're right under the river. And, like, I was like, dude, I'm leaving that in some things, make it look all drippy, make it look old and stuff like that. And uh, so I'm going to work on some sort of armory design. I was just thinking maybe just, like, a wall right down the center, make it like a locker room. And uh, a lot of people were like, dude, you need to do the lockers from things to build. So what will make this cool is we can do a wall right down the middle. And then I'll put item frames all along the wall, and then right below the item frame, the chest. So it'll say what is in each chest. So we'll have, like, on one side, swords and bows. On the other side, armor, you know. So it'll just be like, that's where you get all your weapons. And then, you know, on each side, we'll just have lockers. And then we can probably just, you know, space out four lockers on each side. And then, you know, you'll have eight total for all the security guards. I think that'd be cool. I think that'd be cool. I kind of thought of that on the spot because I remember that someone wanted me to do uh, lockers in here. And I was like, where could I put lockers? I was like, wait, this is going to be like the locker room for these guys. So why not? And uh, I had some comments saying what I should do for the floor. Uh, I had cracked stone brick, which I do not have. I don't know how to get that unless it's in strongholds, which I would have to go on like a mission to get that. But I'd be willing to, to actually get it. But someone says I had cobblestone and uh, mossy cobblestone and that'll actually make it look old I'm kind of all for that I think that'll look kind of good but I'm also leaning towards some sort of wood design but wood doesn't really seem practical because this is meant like a fall shelter is meant to like last for like years and wood is just not gonna last for years so I think you guys kind of understand why that wouldn't be good someone said I should use nether brick and make a nether brick floor and I I literally went and gathered a bunch of netherrack and smelted it and like it took four stacks to get one stack. So that idea is no. I am not doing that because that involves a lot of work and I am freaking oh that's just that's a lot of work. That is a lot of work. And this chest is full. Are you kidding me? Wow, I'm gonna have to go get some other stuff. But I'm gonna go sleep real quick and then I'm gonna get some stuff done because I'm kinda like debating on what I should start doing first, but I think I'm just gonna get the the center wall built, which shouldn't take too long in the uh, security room, and then I'll start doing the lockers. I gotta remember how to do the lock design. I think it was a pressure plate right in front of it, but I think since pressure plates, like, people could step on, it could be an accident. I think I'm not gonna use those, maybe I'll just put a button on the side, because I think that'll just look a bit nicer. It could be, like, your little combination lock, but in reality, it's just a button, but whatever. You gotta use your imagination. That's what makes it fun. Oh man. For eight iron doors, you're gonna need six. So six times eight is 
What's six times eight? Got to do math here. Not doing it in my head. Too lazy. And that's probably a really simple thing to do in my head. But there's a really easy solution to this. It's called you go to the crafting bench and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There we go. Now uh, you do 64 minus 16, and I still don't feel like doing math, so whatever, we're moving on. Alright, um, what else do I need? I'm gonna need chests, do I have chests in here? I do not. Oh, I think I put a crafting table in it, and then I put chests. I think that's what was in the build. If it was not, then you guys gotta yell at me in the comments so I can correct it later on after this uploads. But as of right now, you know, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna go with a chest and a crafting table, because I think that's what went in it. I could customize it actually thinking about it i think this would make more sense a crafting table meh we're gonna put bookshelves in it because it'll add some color to it or maybe we'll add both you know give the guys a little variety where they could have either their books to read in the off time or or did i just put it in there oh put an iron door in there not paying attention to what i'm doing because i'm uh i am not the smartest man and so i'm uh i'm very sad lately i'm sad due to the fact that the update is still not out yet but I don't want to start a new world. I feel I have to because my my world seed is actually very far behind. I started this like I think in December, and so I have strongholds where they they lack end portals. Um, when a new update comes, like my Nether didn't even have fortresses in it, so I couldn't get a blaze rod to do brewing. Like I was very behind with the times, so. I think I definitely need to do a new world, but I feel like I'm putting so much effort into this world and I don't want to change it. But with the new jungle biomes being added, like, I definitely want to actually be building in a jungle biome. But I, I love the whole zombie, like, post-apocalyptic sort of idea to build in. It makes survival fun for me. So if I'm living in a jungle, I don't know how I can go by doing that. So, my plan is, is I think when I start a new world and I live in a jungle, I, am I on the... Okay, yeah, I'm on the second floor, or the, the first floor, whatever floor. My plan is for uh, when I start a new world, is I'm going to be living in the trees, but I'm going to be running a side project elsewhere that will be like a zombie apocalypse area. So, you know, I'm going to be I'm gonna be living in the jungle, have my happy little, happy little tree village or whatever that will, uh, you know, represent like the Ewoks from Star Wars or something like that, because I think that's really cool. I definitely want to do something like that. But uh, I definitely still want to do something zombie related so I'm definitely gonna be doing something like that on the side so I'll probably do a lot of work off camera with it but I'm definitely gonna be doing a a lot of stuff on camera related to it if you guys get what I mean oh no uh oh that ooh, we can't do that now we can't uh, we can't put lockers on this wall because well technically on this wall because that goes to the other room so what could I do over here I could go one here one here one here three there and two there, and two there, and that equals not enough. Crap. Crap. Maybe I could do one side, and then the other side could be, like, showers? That wouldn't be smart. Um, crap. What do I do? Dang it. See? This is why you gotta think things through. You can't wing it on these things. Alright. Um, hmm. First, let's just, let's just put the, maybe we can just do it all on one side. Maybe it's all, uh, no! Oh, God, I deleted too many. Okay, that could be one two jesus freaking pickaxe sucks i can't wait to make a new one said i was gonna grind out and get level 30 off camera for my shovel and my axe did not have the time because i turned into a state of decay legend i freaking flip oh wait how many that's four and then we go five six dang it nothing is in my favor today dang it hold on hold on hold on gotta assess the problem here so that's six all along the wall. And then... Screw it! Six is enough. No, it's not. I gotta work with this. Work with it. Work with it. Oh, dang it. This is making me sad. Maybe we could just put a door right here. And, like, you can't actually get inside. Like, it's just for show. You guys okay with that? I'm okay with that. Because, uh, you know. You know we, gotta, we gotta understand here that we're trying to... We're trying to, like, implicate this into it. It wasn't meant to be in a room like this. So, we're kind of screwed when we try to do it. If you guys get what I mean. Alright, so... Wait, wait, hold on. How do I, how do I, how do I play? Yeah, there we go. One. Then. 
two. I'm not really doing measurements right now. I'm kind of winging it to see if this uh, lands perfectly on the way I want it to be. Is that correct? Is that correct? No! Why is nothing working for- Dang it. This is just depressing for me. Oh well. Oh well, I'll figure- The whole lockers thing was never planned with this. I literally just remember the comment right before I started recording. I was like, you know what? I'll try adding that in. And trying to add that in is really proving to be a pain right now. But I do want to do it. I could just do six along the wall. But I felt eight was necessary because- you're going to have eight beds. Because I can't do six beds. I can do four beds or I can do eight. We can't do bunk beds in one room and then not bunk beds in the other. That would just suck. All right, so wait. One, two. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That hurt my eyes. One, two. Th okay, we can do three there. We can do three there. And then... Oh, hold on. Hold on. I'm clutching right now. I'm being awesome. Wait, is that the center? That the center? That's the center. Yep, that's the center. Move you tortures. You're not helping anyone. Boom. That's three. That's three. Looking good. All right. And now we got five left over. So we're gonna go. We're gonna go one, and then we're gonna go one, two, three, and then we're gonna go one, two, three. And then we're gonna go one, two, three. Dang it! I really need to count out these measurements. This is just god awful. Dang it! I'm, I apologize, everyone. I'm uh, I'm definitely sort of derping right now. But I'm really, I'm really kind of winging it on it. again. The lockers, not something that I expected to throw in here. Now that I'm doing it, it's really proven to be a bit. All right, you know, those three can stay right now, and we can figure something out. Like, wait, hold on, hold on. I got this. Hold on. All right, so these are all spaced one apart. So we'll just go one there, and one there. So that looks good. Then we'll go. One there, and then one there, boom. Now we got this one odd man who can't go anywhere. Screw it, there's seven security guards. The eighth security guard is the head chief dude who doesn't do anything. He's just going to sit there. There. I'm content with it. No, I'm really not content with it. Dang it. I'm really I'm unhappy right now. Nothing's working in my favor, but whatever. So back to the whole, I'm a state of decay legend. So, yesterday... For about four or five hours, I sat down and I learned State of Decay. I put my foot down and I was like, no one else is dying. Let me tell you, no one else died. At least, at least not that I know of. People may have died in the, uh, recently, like, once I, lo like, I guess logged off the game. Because the game hates me. The game goes, here's a bunch of people, they're all fine, and, you know, your morale is just through the roof. Like, everybody loves you right now, but... We're just going to make them all hate you. Now, man, I need more wood, too. This is just not what... Wait, where's my spruce? Oh, spruce is upstairs, probably. Dang it. Um, so, I have my morale, like, through the roof. I have outposts everywhere. No one's going missing. My morale is just awesome. Everyone's loving me. And, uh... And then I log up the game, because I, I don't really, like... I don't really like the way the game saves. It just hates you. And, oh, uh, wait, hold on, hold on. One, two, three! Yes! Yes! No! Yes, no, that's not gonna work out too well for me. Crap. Because, uh. Ah, uh, because I can put weapon, weapon, maybe a third weapon, depending on what it could be. Who knows? An axe, maybe a hatchet. And then over here, I would need four for armor. Ah, dang. This, uh, this whole security. Security room really kinda being a jerk to me, and I'm not liking it. I really am not liking it. Oh well. Oh well. Alright. Uh, what I was saying was. My morale is great. I don't like the way the game saves. And so, once I figured it was saved, I exited the game and I was like, I'm just going to reload the game to make sure everything's all good. Reload the game, freaking, my morale is, like, down. And I guess when your morale's down, it makes it where people start to, uh, like, they, they panic more or they, like, get fear and it's like, someone needs talking to, blah, blah, blah. But all in all, I'm doing, it, I'm doing pretty well at the game now. I think I've recovered a lot. Like, I've... My population was at 5 when you guys last saw it. I'm not trying to spoil anything, but my population is now at 12. Like, I'm definitely doing, uh, I'm recovering. I'm recovering from the battle that was, that was had. And where's my spruce wood? I chopped so much of it. Where on earth is it? Seriously, I finished the wood beer wall, by the way. I should have, uh, I, why did I just lose connection to Xbox Live? Why does this hate me right now?
This game, uh, everything just sucks right now. I'm just trying to hang out, play some Minecraft. Is my skin gone now? No, I'm the same guy. Because every time, if you lose connection to Xbox Live, it's like, Skin Pack 3 is unavailable, but every other Skin Pack is there. And, uh, you know, it hates me. And, yeah, the Woodbury Wall is right here. So, so yeah, that's kind of cool. Sorry for the derpy episode, guys, but things just, you know, you kind of have one of those days where nothing goes in your favor. Like, I didn't really have time since I was doing my whole State of Decay, like, just, like non-stop no life playthrough to learn the game i had no time to work off camera so yeah things are just things are not going good and where's my spruce wood oh oh it's in my inventory wonderful wonderful now everyone's just gonna just comment and yell at me and say i'm a derp which i am i i, I freaking i glanced at it thought it was nether nether brick that's that's my excuse. I hate my life right now. This is just... This sucks. This sucks so bad. Oh, well. Oh, well. We're going to recover from this. We are going to recover. And I probably lost half my viewership right now, but we're fine. For those of you that are sticking with me, I appreciate it. All right. Back downstairs. Cause, wait, nope. Back upstairs. Because we need... We need our... What's it called? We need our... Our leather. We need leather. We need sticks. We already had some sticks. Then we're needing item frames, so we're going to go over her and make only two, because that's all I can afford right now. We're going to make a bunch of sticks, a lot of sticks. Need as many sticks as possible. That eight, that should be enough. Bam, bam, ba-boom. Awesome. Awesome. But yeah, the wood beer wall isn't entirely finished. I still have near the tiki bar i got to work on, but I've connected it all the way around the arena, and it's quite nice. It is quite nice. <gasps> Am I downstairs? Dude, I am not paying attention all that well right now. I'm trying to, but this is just... Nothing's working in my favor right now. It really isn't. So, boom, boom, boom. Now I'm going to need stuff to add in. So, I think what I may just do is... I may just do... Chest plate, pants, and boots. I don't know if helmet's necessary. I guess that's my way around this, since this is kind of an awkward position I'm in. Maybe, maybe just off-camera I will extend this wall back one because I think that's my main problem right now because I could probably fit all these on evenly because I think this is odd room I think it's a 7 by 13 and I think that's my main problem so I'm just gonna get this stuff set up the way I want it right now but I'm just gonna extend it by one off camera I think that could work I don't know if I'm definitely gonna do that because I'm kind of feeling the old the chest pants uh, sort of boot sort of thing but I don't know it's kind of it's debatable it's very debatable I don't know what I'm gonna do but you know I think I'm a I'm content with that right now because it looks fine who's really gonna be down here the only thing I'm uh I'm kinda picky on is the locker situation right now and that's cuz I kinda got screwed over with this right over here maybe maybe I could make it not look like that room maybe I could just fill in right here and it could be a different room now I kinda like it looking like this it kinda creates a spacious environment and now we need to actually work on this room over here so we gotta you gotta do this. And man, my pickaxe is about to break. I'm sad now. I don't wanna lose this pickaxe. I've had it for so long. I'm not gonna go through the process of burying it. This pickaxe just sucked on breaking three. I've been waiting for this bad boy to break for forever so I can make a new pickaxe. And like, nothing was stopping me from making a pickaxe, but it's like, come on. This thing just, just sucked. But I had to use it. It's just a, it's like a work pickaxe because it doesn't serve any purpose when it comes to getting diamonds or anything. It's just, it's a hard labor pickaxe, and that's what I like it for. All right, just fill these in. I'm going to need to make beds, and I freaking need some wool, I think. I feel like I'm going to sneeze because I am I think I'm getting sick. <coughs> oh, God. I'm sorry, guys. That was loud. Oof. Jesus. Oh, that felt nice, though. Now I feel relieved. All right, get rid of that. And then, oh, we got some iron, too. Look at this. This game loves me. I can just had to use iron for iron doors. Now I get more iron just to, just thrown right back at me. They're like, here you go. Ooh, but but all in all, things are going good lately. Things are going good with with State of Decay. I'm actually really actually enjoying that game now that I I guess learned to play it. Like I didn't fully learn it, but the fact that I set up outposts, I understood that outposts make it so your uh, your survivors don't get lost as much. Um like clearing out infestations was I guess like it was a uh, a dead giveaway that was something I needed to do but I never really like they always intimidated me cuz you know I lost Marcus when I uh, when well I didn't really go for an infestation I just ran to a feral and feral still scared the crap out of me like I I will not fight one unless I'm in a car like if I see one and I'm in a car I will literally 
hunt it down because I know I can kill it. But if I'm on foot and I come across feral, I am running. Like, I'm not dealing with that because that thing just destroyed me. I had a freaking shotgun and I blasted in the face and it just didn't die. And, uh, but just overall, I think I'm doing a lot better. I'm doing better with the game and I'm happy with that. And do I have wool down here? How do I only have three wool? Didn't I have a stack? Holy crap, now I gotta go find some freaking wool. Well, I don't gotta find it, I have more, but it's like, jeez, I still have a sheep farm too. Why are animals getting back here? Is it because of the flowers? I think Wolf mentioned something like that. He said, uh, said something about, like, yellow flowers cause sheep to spawn. Something like that. I don't know. I don't know if it's true. It could be, but I don't know. I don't, uh, I don't do, oh my god, is my door open? I thought my door was open. I thought I was slacking and left my door open. Cause that would have been bad. I need more torches, cause nothing is really going to my favor right now. Oh, and of course, I'm out of white wool. I got four of that, seven of that, four of that. I don't use colored wool for, uh, oh, hello. Uh, I don't use colored wool for my, for my, what's it called, for my beds. I think white wool is the, the most expendable. So I'm gonna run out here and attempt to get some, uh, some wool I know I have in this chest without getting blown up or something like that. Oh, I love this, though. I love the, just walking out here and seeing the scenery. I think, though, for my next build, once I complete the fallen shelter, that, oh... Oh, that makes me sad. Rainy. Um, right there, where you can see a zombie right over there. On that plot of land where I was going to put a house, I'm going to put the gun store. Gun store is going to take a lot of uh, a lot of work because... Ooh, look at that. Ooh, I got beds in here already. Thank you. Just take all the beds. Just put that away. Put that away. God, I feel like I'm going to get creeper blasted in a second. I am going to die. Oh, God. Take that, and then... 19 wool should be enough. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, yeah, I want to do the gun shop, but... Uh, using brick for the gun shop will be a pain because I have nowhere near enough brick. I probably have a stack. Oh, jeez, my voice went out there. That wasn't even a voice crack. That was like, I lost my voice for a second. Don't get me wrong. I will I will openly admit to my voice cracking, but that actually felt like my voice just dropped there. Um, yeah, so I'm only at a stack and then 40 in, you know, there's only so much clay in the world. I don't know if I could get that much. So if I make it, I may go, because uh, I think I used birch wood with it maybe I'll just use or I use spruce wood in the build maybe I'll use birch wood as the uh, color for brick or stone brick or something like that I'll have to substitute it because I don't think I'll be able to acquire enough brick I'll try to but the odds of me getting that much I think are actually pretty slim that's like a lot of brick I'll have to acquire but I could try it but I definitely want to build that gun store because I think it will definitely sort of fit in right there and it'll be cool to explain where we get all our weaponry and such and I just think that'd be cool, and I'm, uh, you know, I'm kind of excited to build it, but I think I'm going to do a lot of the work for it off camera, because it's just going to be a lot of me being like, oh, hold on, I gotta go look at a picture, hold on, I gotta go look at, uh, you know, look at the video, whatever the case may be, so, yeah, that's kind of going to be what it is, so hopefully you guys, hopefully you guys understand that, because, uh, you know, I can, I can understand why that'd be kind of, you know, irritating to watch, you have to watch me AFK every two seconds to, uh, you know, to, oh, Torch, why are you, why are you being a jerk, who do you think you are? Yeah, if you watch me, like, AFK every two seconds to, uh, you know, look at a picture, that would be kind of a pain. It wouldn't be the most enjoyable experience. But that's kind of what it is when you have to replicate a build. you got to constantly look at the picture because, you know, that's, that's the way it is. You know, I can't just remember, you know, in my head. I can probably remember the base measurements, but I don't remember every aspect of the build. That's just, that's just a pain. Is this pickaxe ever going to break? Don't get me wrong. I, I love it, but it's... It's on its way. Probably, not, probably, you know, stuff I'm going to be doing off camera will end up destroying it. And I need, I need a crafting bench. Do I have one on me? No, I do not. Thank God. I didn't bring it. Uh, I was going to feel a little, little silly there. Three and four. There we go. Awesome. Awesome. Just go like that. One there. Did I add uh, anything on the end? I know I added doors, but I don't know if I put a chest. Did I put a chest in the middle? I probably did. It was probably... Storage for the whole world. Let's go check it out. But yeah, that's uh, I think that's the main thing I'm lacking right now is wood. Gotta gotta go get wood. Cause I uh, I got a stack yesterday, and you can see I'm already using a good majority of it. Yeah, put a chest and then some doors, and then that was it for the room. So that's cool. So I can finish those up, call it an episode, and then I actually do need to do some work off camera. I need to prep some supplies for the next couple of builds. Cause I don't really know what I'm gonna do for the other ones. I know I want to do overseer. And I want to do kitchen, something like that. Kitchen shouldn't be too hard, but the overseer is kind of a pain because I do want to replicate it like it's Fallout, but in Fallout, the overseer's office is, like, round. Like, it's like a round, well, I don't know if it's a rounded room, but the desk is round. How do you make a round desk? That's the question. Probably not too hard, but I would need sort of a spacious room. 
And uh, you know, I gotta, I gotta dig all that out. I gotta figure out what I want to do. Two, three, four. There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Boom. Add that in there. Whoop. Add that. There we go. One room down. One room to go. So we're gonna add this in. Everything's gonna look great. It's gonna look wonderful. Whoa, am I floating? Oh, oh you can't see below me. Dang it. There we go. Awesome. Two rooms down. We can actually leave that there. Community crafting table. But yeah, so I think off camera I am going to extend this room out because this room is just being a pain because it's the uh, it's the same size as the classroom. I was like, you know, what? that'll probably be a decent measurement. But since I'm trying to work with an even number in an odd room, uh, it's just not going to work with me. So if I extend this one more, I'll be able to put four chests along each wall. Uh, if I do, if I extend this by one, I will be able to. I hope fit all the lockers on there. That's what I gotta figure out. When you're trying to record that and then talk and try to be entertaining while figuring out all your measurements, it just doesn't work. It doesn't work. It would have been it would have been an ideal time to cut away and really kind of sit down and figure out what I need to do. But I don't like cutting away my videos. That's just not something I'm a fan of. But maybe maybe I'll do it when the time is necessary. But right now I'm not okay with it. But yeah, guys, that is gonna be it for this video. So you know, like always, if you enjoyed the video, please do leave it a like. Don't forget to subscribe. And, you know, see ya.